Meanwhile, the death toll from the Pacific Northwest heat wave is still climbing as more intense heat is on the way. In Washington, at least 78 deaths are now being blamed on scorching temperatures, with as many as 20 of those deaths in Spokane County. Meanwhile, authorities in North Idaho say there have been zero deaths tied to the heat in the gem state. So is that true? Our Morgan Trout verifies. It's a valid question since we were hit with the same scorching temperatures as North Idaho. So I did some digging to find out if North Idaho escaped the heat wave with zero heat related deaths. Let's start with our sources. I reached out to the Panhandle Health District, county coroners in Idaho's five northern counties, hospitals, law enforcement, and county commissioners. We also heard from Craig Etherton, Coeur d'Alene Fire Department spokesperson. Have you seen any heat-related deaths? We haven't uh, in our area yet. Despite Spokane County being mere miles away, no heat-related deaths are being reported in North Idaho. According to the Panhandle Health District, not a single heat-related death has been reported within the five counties the district serves. We wanted to investigate further. Typically, coroner's offices have the most up-to-date information, so that's where we went. Each county coroner confirmed they have not had a single case. We found the same statistic from the Coeur d'Alene Police, Kootenai Health, Kootenai County Sheriff's Office, and the Kootenai County Commissioners. So how is it possible that Spokane can have 17 confirmed and three most likely heat-related deaths? Etherton says there are three main reasons. A smaller community, the Panhandle Health District serves approximately 250,000 people within those five counties. Spokane County has nearly double that. He says having fewer people allows for faster response time, neighbors checking in on each other more frequently, and community members reaching out to law enforcement or firefighters. Newer housing. At least in Coeur d'Alene, he says a large population of the city live in homes that were built in the past 20 years. These homes are more likely to have air conditioning. And the environment. Lake Coeur d'Alene is able to provide some relief from the hot sun. We, we, we still are small enough uh, to have that, that kind of tight community feel and, and be looking out um, for each other. And, and that's not to say that, you know, folks in Spokane don't care about their neighbors, but, um, you know, it's a, it's a bigger town. There's a lot more people there. Uh, it's, it's, harder to, it's harder to proportionally be able to check on, um, check on those people. So we can verify that yes, North Idaho has so far not seen any heat related deaths, but it is important to consider the differences between the two regions. We are still tracking the heat related deaths in our area and will continue investigating what led up to them occurring and could there have been anything done to help prevent them. Do you have something you'd like verified? Email us at verify at In the newsroom, Morgan Trow, Krem2 News.